Hi everybody. So this is my HP DeskJet printer 3632. It allows you to print, scan and copy. You can also send documents over email to the printer and it will print for you. So fairly uh, decent printer for the price that you can get it for. And uh, along with this printer I got a HP Instant Ink membership free. And I tried it for a couple of months, but I wasn't printing enough. So I canceled that subscription. And with when you cancel the HP Instant Ink subscription, your cartridges stop working. And even though the cartridges are fairly new and used, you see them that they are showing empty, the color and the black and white. And also the icon shows that you need to order print uh, cartridges or basically reactivate your subscription. So all in all, this uh, cartridge is not working for me anymore. So I need to replace the cartridge with standard cartridges. For my printer model, you need to use number 623 cartridges. And I've got the green project cartridges from Walmart. So this is uh, approximately half the price of the regular HP cartridge and it says that it is compatible with my printer 3632 right there at the top and uh, same for the black one yeah so it's uh, cheaper and it says it's green project so i may as well try it let's see how well it works just to show you what these cartridges are about it says that it is remanufactured in cartridge and they still claim to produce deep sharp black prints consistently for professional looking documents this is the black cartridge and for the color cartridge it says produces vibrant colors for lifelike photos vivid graphics and stri striking color presentations this has been performance tested quality assured and these are recycled cartridges so let's see so here are the contents of the color cartridge box you got the cartridge here and then a quick start guide and then some installation instructions. So they basically talk about that standard steps on how to install and how to take care of the cartridge and the printer or how to improve the print quality if required. So if you see the HP cartridge that I had installed already in my printer is much bigger than the new green project cartridge even though it says Excel. So the reason for that is that in Instant Ink program, HP wants to send minimum number of cartridges by post. That's why they make the tank really big, as you can see. Now I'm going to install the green project cartridge and see if it works. So I've installed the cartridge, the color cartridge that is, and looks like it has been recognized. So I'll go ahead and install the black cartridge as well. So similar to the color cartridge, the black HP cartridge is much bigger than the XL. This is the instant ink cartridge and this is the green project cartridge. So yeah. So I'll go ahead and install the black cartridge from Green Project. Don't forget to remove this tab. Okay, so both cartridges are installed and recognized. That error message that was blinking here has also gone. And I can hear the printer trying to do something. So yeah, now the final test is actually trying to print something. So the printer has started to print something automatically before I could send a signal. So let's see what that is. Maybe a test page. 
checking the heads and everything. Okay, so this printer has printed a page to help improve the quality of printing. And I think that's pretty standard. We've seen this a few times. At least I have seen this even with the old cartridges. I'm going to skip this for now and see if I can print directly. Okay. So that's the printer that came, but it's pretty small. Probably I should have selected a bigger image. So let me try with a bigger image. Okay, so this is another attempt to print, test print my printer. Uh, take two, basically. Okay. Yeah, so this looks perfect. I just need to print a color image to confirm the color cartridge is working fine as well. So this is the color image test and I've chosen the draft quality. So it won't be perfect, but this looks pretty awesome actually. Even with draft quality. Yeah, you see a few lines there, but that's because I chose the draft quality, but this is, this was just a test page. So yeah, this is uh, great. So I think the ink levels haven't dropped almost at all. So I'm pretty happy with these cartridges the ease of installation and the quality of print. Given that I don't print very heavily, I expect these cartridges to last over a year. Based on your requirement, you could also consider remanufactured cartridges and see if it works for you. Thank you for watching and see you next time. If you like this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing to the channel. This would mean a lot to us. Thank you.